private one. I have uh, some uh, products from Julie Candles in today to show you. So I actually have a candle and two packs of tarts. So let's get right into it. And with the tarts, I actually will have a reveal at the end of each one. So I'll show you the tarts first. I'm not going to be able to do a reveal on the candle because I only just got these products in today. So I have two of the three ounce wax tarts. I got the banana pudding and I got the pumpkin spice. I'm going to say very honestly that as far as their products go, the Jewelry Candles tarts are, in my opinion, are not necessarily superior in synthro and strength to their candles. These are a little bit weaker in my opinion. So as you can see I actually have that they do come with a little sachet and there is jewelry in the sachet. So these are the banana pudding wax tarts. Nice pale yellow wax color. And yep, these are three ounce tarts. And like I say, this is the banana pudding. And this, it's light, I'll be very honest. I probably won't get much from these scents until I'm actually melting them. Mm. But I am getting a very light hint of banana from uh, this particular scent. It smells really good, actually. Um, this scent is new to me. I've never had it from Julie Candles before. So, I'm going to put that aside. And that one has jewelry with it, as I showed you. Both sets of tarts will have jewelry. And this one has the sachet with the jewelry piece as well. I don't like when they get snagged like that. Oh, dear, dear, dear. That one close is kind of awkwardly. But this is their pumpkin spice, which I've done in a candle, which I've uh, done on this channel before, and I love how that smells. So let's see how the tarts hold up in comparison with the candle. Again, you got that beautiful pale wax color. It's orangish. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. Mmm. There are some exceptions, of course. There will be exceptions. Some wax scents are going to be stronger than others, and this is a stronger scent. It smells good, actually. I love it. it. Smells really good. And this one has a little jewelry piece. Actually, I can see it from inside. It looks pretty. Really nice, but again, we'll, we'll, I'm gonna be a good girl and save the reveal for after I've done the candle bit. And here's the candle that I ordered. It's a nice, uh, pale, like a beige tan kind of wax color. And this is actually this is not jewelry that's in here. This is one of their pearl candles. I have done reveals from their pearl candle before as well as their pearl party bath bomb uh, they're, they're nice they have nice pearls inside their products double wicked as always and the scent is cinnamon bun smells good it is light uh I will admit very honestly, when it comes down to cinnamon bun, this is a scent that I have to be careful with. I love cinnamon scents, but they don't love me as much, if that makes any sense. Sometimes they give me headaches, and it makes me miserable because I want so much to enjoy the scents. And sometimes they just bother me, so I hope, I'm hoping this one will actually not be so bothersome because it is a lighter scent. Um, it could change as they burn it. I've never had cinnamon bun from Jewelry Candles before for the very reason I've described is the fact that I can be a little sensitive to certain scents. Sometimes they give me headaches. This one 
this cinnamon bun scent might be okay. I hope so. There will be a genuine pearl, a loose pearl, inside of this candle. And I know for a fact that if you are lucky, it does specifically say, or it did specifically say at one point, that if you are lucky with the pearl candles, sometimes your pearl will actually come with, you know, a necklace or something like that as a part of the uh, part of the package. It's a, it's a rare surprise if you actually get a necklace or charm or something with the pearl, but uh, that can't happen. So, I don't know. Is there a, a completed jewelry piece in here, or is it just loose pearl? I'll have to burn it and find out, won't we? Yep, like I say, good candles. I like the fact that they're double wicked. I rarely have any issues with these candles. And even if I do run into issues, they are very easy to correct because of the double wick. So, mm. put that on my candle shelf. And now we'll get back to the two tarts and reveal uh, the jewelry pieces. We'll do, we'll, we'll do the ring first. I did a ring and a bracelet. So, I already had a, a good peek at the ring and it looks This this is interesting. Different actually. Some some of their jewelry looks a little uh, juvenile, and other pieces look a lot more sophisticated. So it really is a mixed bag. Oh hello! It's stamped too. This piece is actually stamped. For a, for a wonder. It's a very faint stamp, but it is their J.C. Hallmark. I know you're probably not going to be able to see it inside the band. But there is a very small stamp in there, so that's cool. You don't really run into pieces that are stamped as often from this company, but it, it, it can happen. This is actually really cute. I like it. This is a butterfly. It's a butterfly ring with little clear stones. So, try the size. It is pretty. Like I say, it's very unusual to actually come across marked rings. And uh, like I say, the, the jewelry styles are so eclectic. You just, it's really hard to say for sure if you're going to get something you like or not. But there are, um, there's trading groups and other things like that on uh, Facebook and other places, just in case you don't like the jewelry piece you get. I always encourage you to uh, check out the trading groups and things like that, just to see if there's anything that someone else got from a product that you might like. And now let's get on to the second piece, which is a bracelet. This, this bracelet looks different from the other bracelets I've gotten. I had one repeat just recently of a bracelet, but I liked the design well enough, so I didn't care very much. Oh, this is cute. Oh. This is a different class, also from the bracelets I've gotten in the past. That's different. Wow. Again, no sign of a stamp. This is th this bracelet is different from the other ones I've gotten in the past. Wow, the other ones had the, the fold over clasp. Can you see that this one actually has the uh, adjustable chain on it with a lobster claw? That is, that is really neat. I like that. I like that. Oh, I'm gonna. Oh, this is cute. Oh, I like this. I like this. There are some stations on the bracelet. 
This one has a couple of uh, cut out diamond panes. I'm not sure how well you can actually see that. They are cut out diamond design panes right there. And then uh, you have a couple of uh, plain links in between. And then uh, here's another different pane that has clear stones and it rotates on the other side and then it leads up to this uh, little flower of some clear stones. I like this. This is very, very different. Oh, I like, oh, and the stations here are kind of twisted as well. That's kind of different. I didn't really notice that at first. It's really cool. So each of these little station bars has a different stylization to it. You got a couple of plain ones, then you get the diamond panes, the uh, diamond bar, and then the flower held together with the uh, twist bars. That's a, that's a lot of detail for this little bracelet. And then you have at the very bottom the lobster claw chain clasp. That, that, that's really awesome. I like that. So, wow, this will have some real possibility. I wonder if you can actually extend it to where it almost is like an anklet, I wonder. That'd be interesting. I'll have to do some experimentation and find out for sure if that can actually be done. But, yeah. Okay. So this one's actually really different, and I really like it. I like this one a lot. So, okay, that, that's really cool. That is really cool. I'm going to tuck that aside and all that stuff. And I'm just going to do a very quick, quick recap. And I, I do note that these also come in their, each pack of tarps came in their own sachet as well. So I, I do would like to point that out as a matter of interest. So we have the two tarps and pumpkin spice and banana pudding with their respective jewelry pieces and their own respective sachets and we have the cinnamon bun scented pearl candle so that was my order from jewelry candles love the products love the jewelry they're great pieces and yeah that's what I have to show you this time. Definitely uh, check out the affiliate link in the description if you want to order for yourself. And yeah, that, that's what I got for now. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys again real soon. Bye everybody.